Hey there, in this video I'm going to show you how to take a popular Strava KOM, even if you're not that fast. You're probably thinking, dang it Bruce, how can I take a popular KOM if I'm slow? Well, I can answer it like this. It's easy to be faster than others if, you, if the others don't know they're racing against you. Well, what I mean by that is, you can create your own Strava segment, then anyone who rides through that segment, new, through that newly created segment, even if they rode through it in the past, will be on the leaderboard. But of course they didn't know that the segment existed or would exist in the future and therefore they weren't really trying to get that segment. With this strategy you have like a window of time to grab the KOM before all the rest of the people even realize that the segment that you created even exists. So here's a segment I created some time ago earlier this year. I don't remember exactly when and I never got around to trying to take the KOM on it. I watch the times get faster and faster throughout the year, but over the past couple of weeks I've been attempting to take the KOM on this segment which I created. Once Strava has populated the leaderboard, you can actually check the average speed of the current KOM holder to give you an idea if it's realistic to be able to take that KOM. In my case, the segment I made was just over one kilometer long with the average speed to beat at 41.3 kilometers an hour. So I knew it would be close and I decided to give it a go. Remember to roll into your segment at near or full speed so you don't waste time accelerating in the segment. And at the end, if it's safe to do so, don't break or slow down until you cross the finish line. For my attempt, I made three close but ultimately failed attempts at the KOM. So that brings me to what I had to do today, which is a more controversial option. That is to use the wind. Pretty self-explanatory. If advantageous, wait for a windy day so you get an extra wind boost that you'll need to gain the speed to take the KOM. So here's a video of that successful KOM grab. So there you have it. That's how you can take a popular KOM, even if you're not that fast. If you have any additional tips or comments, let me know in the comment box below. And also let me know what you think about using the wind to help you out. Is that cheating or is that just kind of the way it is? Okay, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.